In problem number 46 of section 2.1, we're given a pile of sand that's uh, sitting in the shape of a right circular cone with, uh, height, uh, with a height fixed of 10 meters. And we're assuming that we're adding sand in a way such that only the radius of the cone is changing. Uh, so in other words, as we add more sand, the height is still fixed at 10 meters. And we want to know what is the rate of change of the volume of the cone, or how much the amount of sand that we have, with respect to the radius. So the first step is um, to set up an equation that relates um, the volume of the cone with the radius. Well, we know that uh, the volume of a right circular cone is one-third times the volume of the uh, cylinder that it fits inside of. So in other words, the um, volume of the cylinder with, uh, or the circular, right circular cylinder with base, uh, or with radius of r, and height of h. So one-third uh, pi r squared times h. But in this case, h is fixed at 10 meters. So we have 10 pi over 3 r squared. Uh, will give us the volume when the radius is equal to r. And we want, so we actually write this as v of r. And we want the rate of change of the volume with respect to the radius. So we just take the derivative with respect to r. So using the power rule, we have 20, or excuse me, 2 times 10 pi over 3. And uh, lower the power by 1, which weighs this with r. So the rate of change of the volume of the cone uh, with respect to the radius is 20 pi over 3 times r.